Welcome back everybody to Let's Play Chrono Trigger. In the last episode we discovered that in the year 1999, a creature called Lavos will erupt from the earth and essentially fuck everybody's shit. That's okay, because we're gonna fix it. And also, I hope you guys had a good Christmas yesterday, and if you don't celebrate Christmas then I hope you had a good Tuesday. For now, it's heavily implied that we need to go back around the way we came, uh, and go to the mountain range not too far from this dome. I just hope we're going the right way. Uh, but and can I just say I feel really bad for poor Marley? First, she disappears from known history itself, which caused her to, like, freak out really bad. And then, and then, when she comes back, thanks to her newfound friends, she finds out that the world's going to end anyway. Up, oh, yep. You're back! Oh no, we have to tell them the truth. Well, what did you discover? This is... our future. Who cares? Where's the food? This is all we could get. Seeds. You don't know how long the inner town will hold out. Those seeds might be your only hope. You have to stay alive, and so do we! Huh. You're strange. You're different from us. I think it's because we're healthy. Marley! <laughs> healthy? Got a nice ring to it. We'll try growing the seeds. What are those? They just might be our future. Heading for Protodome? Go by the way of Laboratory 32, and take this with ya. One bike key. It's a key to the jet bike in Lab 32. I used to ride it when I was young. Hope it still works. They've got more powerful robots over there. Take care and stay... healthy. Well, that went better than I expected, but... Thank you, Dome. Good luck, everybody. Oh, great. So here, I think? Yeah. It's a shame these guys don't have an air counter, or at least one that I don't see. I guess we'll just have to, like, make do. I'll have to make do with the island- with the items that we have, because I did not see an inner charming back over there. Let's just... patch everybody up. Do I have any normal ethers? Yes. Okay. This is probably, yeah, Lab 32, exactly where we need to go. Now we just need to find that bike. Oh, and there it is. And boy, is it a beaut. I'd change the yellow parts if I could, but hey, beggars can't be choosers. Uh-oh. You've triggered the security, oh no! Eh? We're not actually... Hold it right there! What that? What the? F Hi? Hey, it's a man. A man? Like, thanks for the intro, babe. The man. Does he? Does this guy talk like a surfer? You lowlifes can call me Johnny. 
or I don't know, maybe sounds like some sort of like, I don't know, 70s leather jacket wearing douchebag. Now listen up, part of an old highway leads to these ruins. Think you can beat me in a bike race? Use that jet bike and don't chicken out, babe. Do you know how to ride? No. I come from a time where there are no such fanciful things. Alright, listen up. Gas is on autos and there's only one speed. Fast. Use the control pad to steer and the B button for a turbo boost. I'll give you three of them, but it takes a moment to recharge between boosts. Check your position at the bottom of the screen. Now show me what you got, babe. Oh boy. Alright, let's go. Last minute boost. Later. I think. You drove this thing pretty well considering you've never touched one before, Chrono. You beat me? I don't get it. You can challenge me to a race anytime. We'll ride the wind, babe. Thanks? Alright. Is that all we had to do? Great. Onward to Protodome. What's this one, though? We can't interact with it. Save now that we have beat some sort of freaky robot man in a bike race. There we go. Protodome. There's, looks like there's security here, too. How many can I hit the cyclone? None. I can only hit full one, but still. Don't do that. Don't do that. That hurts. In the way, this should get rid of one. That gets rid of the other. There we go. Tech points. Probably leveled up. Nice. Okay. More security. I wonder if we can just go this way. Hello. What is this? What's this? It's in bad shape, but it appears to be a humanoid robot. Incredible. Think you can fix it up, Luca? I think I can fix it. What? It might attack us! I'll make sure it won't. Machines aren't capable of evil. Humans make them that way. I mean... She's not wrong. She could basically just, like, teach it not only in either good or, at the very least, Asimov's Law of Robotics. Well, Asimov's Laws, but either way. Luca, you pity them, don't you? Let me get to work now, okay? The door won't budge. Alright, that does it.
I'm gonna give it some juice. Whoa! Good morning! Mo Good morning, mistress. What is your command? I'm not your mistress, I'm Marley. And this is Chrono. And Luca here fixed you! Understood. Madam Luca fixed me. Just Luca will do. Impossible. That would be rude. Look, I hate formal titles, don't you, Marley? Hate him! I understand, Luca. Alright, now what's your name? Name? Ah, my serial number. It is R66Y. R66Y. Cool. No, that won't do at all. Come on, Colonel, let's give him a better name. His name is Robo. Okay, I'm not gonna lie. After the events of Planescape Permit, I was almost tempted to name him Nordum. But no, no, Ro Ro Robo will do. Robo, Robo, that's perfect. Your new name is Robo, okay? I am... Robo. Data storage complete. Hey Robo, why aren't there many people here? What... what has happened here? There were many humans and others of my kind in this dome. I think something awful happened here. It would appear so. But how is it that you survived? You came through a time warp from the year 1000. While exploring Eris Dome, we learned that there was a gate here. We found you when we came looking for the gate. But the door to the inner chamber is locked, so we're out of luck. power is off. If we go to the factory up north, I can pass through security and activate the dome generator. You do that for us? You repaired me. Now it is my turn to help you. But the generator won't run for long, so someone must stay behind to open the door while the power is on. And Marley and I will stay. Oh, Marley or I will stay. Who will stay behind? Uh, I mean, we might need Luca if anything happens to Robo, yeah? So, Marley, why don't you stay behind? Okay, please be careful, Chrono. Alright. Let's take our new robot f friend and go fix the- oh, whoops. Alright. First taste of battle with Robo. First, let's, let's just, like, get rid of a couple. Okay. Rocket punch! Nice! Oh! Oh, I like this guy already! Ooh! Uh, I, uh, I, I don't think I've said this before, but, uh, my boyfriend has actually been really invested in the Let's Plays that I've do, uh, been doing of games that he really enjoyed, and uh, apparently Robo is one of his favorite party members. It's always the robots, first Nordum and now this. But then again, he's kind of a nerd, but that's okay, that's why I love him. Okay, factory. Okay, this doesn't look terribly bad. Override security system zero zero. Uh oh. Acid. Oof. 
I'm assuming it's like the others where it's like... Nope. Let's just beat it up, see what happens. Ones. It does ones. Four. Okay, that's... Not great. I wonder if we can have Luca put it to sleep then. Nope. Seven. Well, it's dead, so that'll do. Robo learns laser spin. Learn dual tech rocket roll. Cool. Okay, so. I guess we're going up this way, and. I'm guessing these are. Yep, those are enemies! That's okay! We can, we can try out this new double tech. I don't know if it's with Chrono and Robo, or Chrono, or uh, Robo and, uh. Yeah, rocket roll. Rocket multi attack. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's do it. Let's do it. Come on. Oh, don't do that, though. That is great. Okay. Let's take out- let's take care of the rest of these. I like that, though. We became a spinning totem pole of death. Ugh, oh, I like Robo already. Ah. Okay, what's this on the wall? Left li lab area, right factory area. We want to go... Caution, do not turn off the conveyor belt in the factory, or the security system will activate and you'll be in danger. Okay. We want to go to the factory area, if I recall correctly. So let's do that, and not turn off the conveyor belt like the like, like the thing said, because, ooh, that would be absolutely no bueno. What the hell? I guess there's no reason for being in there. So, let's see, what's this? What is this? It's a glowing thing, but I can't interact with it. Alright. I'm assuming those futz with the conveyor belts, and I assume that that's not something that I want to do. So let's not, for now. Let's find out what's in here, though. One Robin bow! Marley will be- we'll be- we'll bring Marley back a souvenir! Let's see... We can't get up on the conveyor belts. Or at least not that I know of. Turn it off, or oh, we can't even mess with it. So let's not. Let's just not. What happened? What's going on? Oh God! Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Proto three. I think we unintentionally found a boss fight. Don't hurt my new robot friend. Laser spin all enemies, okay. Well, at least now I know what laser spin does. Photo is out of the way. Taking a ride on the escalators. I'm guessing, oh yeah, we're, we're gonna have to like... Actually better yet, we'll wait, we'll logo, and then we'll do a double tech. Yeah! Don't do that. Oof. Chrono could use some support, so once it's Robo's turn... Will it be Robo's turn? There we go. Cure Beam! Thanks, buddy! And 
been taken care of. Kind of leveled up. Wonderful. Okay. I guess... I, I, I mean, we're running a bit low on time, but I don't think we can stop this pain train, so... Okay. Don't do that, first of all. Robo's not also not looking so hot, so you know what? I'm gonna use a tonic on him. There we go. Yeah, there you go, buddy. Do another rocket roll, because my god, this space is confined. Do some solid damage to all of them. Luca could also use a little bit of healing whenever it comes to be Robo's turn. Then again, Robo could also stand to heal himself, so let's let let's just do that. I'll cyclone everybody, don't worry about it. You just work on patching yourself up, buddy. Check your beam on yourself. There you go, right as rain. There we go, there we go, lots of good stuff. Luca leveled up. If the enemies are getting steadily bigger and bigger, I'm very scared about what's gonna happen next. Are we gonna have to fight the- oh no, we're not gonna have to fight them. Cool. We are gonna have to fight these turtles. No wait, not turtles, beetles. I can't tell. They actually don't look like beetles, I think they're turtles. Oh, shit. Yeah, we're gonna have to fight these turtles. Don't do that. Well, Robo pack up and patch up Luca this round, too. Probably use it. Your beam. Luca. There you go. Don't do that. I just healed her. There we go. The point's got a heal. Nice. Okay. We are running just a tad low on time, but at the same time the generator might be, like, nearby. Yeah, yeah, here it is, but I also smell a boss fight, so, like, let's, uh, use the right menu. And... Wow, he has a lot of HP! Wow, that's a lot. Okay. Use a couple of these. Use a couple of one of these. That'll do it, I hope. Take a couple of these. Nice, nice. Do your thing, Robo. We're in control mode. Code 00XA. Zero zero code 01BB. Zero uh oh. Uh. I don't know what this means. Do, do we have to, like, catch them with the cranes or just. No? We just, we just know how the crane works. Okay, so. Did we check in here already? No, we did not, but there's shit to get here. Shelter and an ether. Is there anything out here? Use the crane. Any two of these letters A A B B X Y after the B. Uh I believe one of the crane codes was B B. So let's see what that do.
It's a barrel. I don't know what that was supposed to do, but I should probably go find out the other code. Oh, wait. I think it was XA, actually, so, like... So, uh... Would you believe me if I said that I had to stop recording for something family-related? And that I forgot to hit record again? Luckily, all you missed was me putting another barrel on the line using the code, uh... XA, but at the same time, though, I still feel really dumb and I'm very sorry. But I guess we'll find out what those two barrels we put on the conveyor belt, uh, did next time on Let's Play Chrono Trigger. I will see you guys then, and take care. Thanks for sticking around till the end. If you like what you saw, please consider leaving a like, a comment, or maybe even subscribing. If you want to see more of my content, there are some recommendations for you on screen right now. See you soon!